We're at the water this afternoon with the first of two ribs. So this is a Zodiac Pro uh, 470, so for just shy of five meters. Um, I think it's a, a nine person rib actually. So these Zodiacs are really well built. Um, very high sort of capacity, weight capacity on them. This one's fitted with a Honda 50 horsepower, four stroke outboard. It's 2006 engine. And this isn't her own trailer actually. This, this uh, is just a, a yard trailer that she's sitting on, but there's a brand new trailer on its way for this rib. But what we're going to do now, we're going to run it in the water. It's got a little center console fitted, no controls, remote steering and stuff like that. So we're going to run it on the river now, show you how this thing performs on their way. The 50 horsepower Honda four stroke outboard is fitted with a three blade aluminium prop and it's a 13 inch pitch, so 13 pitch prop. So we're on the water now in the five meter Zodiac and it's a nice running little boat. Feels very stable in the water. You feel pretty secure whenever you're inside it as well because we've got these big, big tubes on it. Um, it's running well with this Honda 50. Loads of power for the hull. It's getting up on the plane in an instant. Even with a full load of passengers on board, this boat will still get up on plane, no problem, I'm sure. I'm going to put it on plane now, show how quickly it hops up on the plane. We'll run it at sort of cruising speed, at 16, 17 knots, and then we'll open it out to do a full speed run as well. So that, that, that's sort of up at about 28 knots or so. You can see how it performs. Not much in the way of lumpy conditions today to, to try it, to test it. But I have sort of ran over and back across my wake and stuff and it feels super, sol super solid, stable and dry as well. There's no, no water coming up over the tubes. All the tops of the tubes are totally bone dry. So, I mean, it is a Zodiac at the end of the day. They're a really good reputation. These boats very solidly built, very sea kindly hulls. This one's no exception. And this little Honda 50 is running very nicely on this one. So just on that subject, throttle and shift is here, remote controls. It's electric start as well, so you can start and stop here. Then you don't have to worry about a pull cord or anything. Forward, neutral, and reverse are nice and smooth. So you'll see there's a wee tiny bit of bow rise whenever we get her up on plane, and then it settles down very quickly. So we'll give her a, a handful of throttle here. This is us cruising nicely at about 17 knots. It's not creating much of a wash, so you can ski behind it no problem at all. Uh, you're probably going a bit faster for skiing, but there's still no wake. But anyway, it look, runs really nice at this sort of speed. And then we'll open her out to a full speed run. It's going to take us up to about 28 knots or so. Here we go.
that's how the little Zodiac runs. Um, very stable little boat. Doesn't do anything uh, unexpected. Nice and easy to control. You can see I was able to drive it no problem with one hand as well, which is good. You know, whenever the steering wasn't pulling to one side or anything, you're just let, able to let go of the steering wheel if you wanted to, and it would track in a straight line. Engine's running very sweet. Um, there is a bit at top speed, you'll notice maybe a bit of spray coming up off the outboard. If you were trimming the engine out, if you were planning to run everywhere flat out, you probably would set the trim angle um, for your loading, you know, whatever way you've got the boat loaded. Obviously, very light load on board here at the minute, so we could definitely trim it out. Probably another couple of, of spots on the on the actual trim angle pin, but um, that would also reduce the spray that you're seeing out, out the back of it too. But uh, yeah, lovely running boat, great little rib, easy to manage, easy to launch and recover. It's going to be easy to run, easy to maintain, just a good little family fun sports rib or a tender for a bigger cruiser as well. So this is how the Zodiac 470 runs with a Honda 50 horsepower force recovery. Thanks for watching, hope you find it useful.